earn your bachelor's degree at Sierra Nevada College. Spend four years in the Sierra on the shores of Lake Tahoe. Prepare yourself for a lifetime of opportunities. Come visit us and enroll today at sierranevada.edu. I'm here at the loft at the Heavenly Village, and I'm talking with Robert Hall, who is magician extraordinaire, as well as, well, you just do everything here, don't you? I am the Swiss Army knife of the loft, <laughs> pretty much. Uh, yeah, I'm the resident magician here. I run the theater aspect and the magic aspects here at the loft. I book all of our magicians. I'm one of our performers. Like uh, this week, I'm in the show performing our magic fusion show with my show. Uh, but I just had David Luxem, uh, I had David Goldrake in here from Luxembourg the last three weeks. Wow. Oh yeah, an amazing show. He's a Las Vegas uh, magician. We got him on a brief little hiatus between nice. his Las Vegas show. I've got Chipper Lowell and Matt Marcy coming in for the Magic Castle over the next few weeks. I'll have in December T2 for a few weeks from France. An amazing show. He's been up here a few times. Always gets really great reactions. Uh, but yeah, when we bring in other magicians, I'm the one that introduces and opens the show here. And then during the sh show, I'll be out if you're out eating dinner or down at the Village Barn Grill and stuff. I can do close-up magic sleight of hand at your tables for you. So that even if you're not watching the show and you still want to come to the loft and experience the food, the dinner, things like that, you can still have a magical aspect to it. You know, at your table, a little personal close-up sleight of hand right there in your own hands and whatnot, and then you know maybe that spurs you to say maybe maybe we'll try the magic show out. Right. You know, I love the fact that this is an experience when you come here. There's dining. You can come for cocktails. You can come for the show if you want, or you could do all of it at the same time. But it's really neat that you get to come into the bar or into the restaurant and still experience magic while you're dining or having your drink. It was one of the things that they really did try to put together when they were building the place. They wanted the whole aspect to kind of come all together. So whether you're watching the show or you're just having dinner, we have different types of things that can come. And you're going to be able to have the option to experience magic if it's what you want to do and whatnot. But you really can't. We have people that come in just to have the drinks, people that come in just for the right. food. And we have people that just come in for the show. And a lot of people like to try to do it all together as one big evening out. Fantastic. All right, so that's really cool that you have these international magicians coming, really from all over the world. Oh, absolutely. Like I said, T2 from France, David Goldrake from Luxembourg. We've had Steve Valentine and Billy Kidd uh, from the UK and London. We really do bring in the best of the best. Every one of our magicians, Magic Castle members, you've seen them on Penn and Teller's Fullest, Masters of Illusion, a lot of the different TV shows, Tonight Shows, things like that. We really do bring in some of the best working magicians from all over the world to perform here at The Loft. It really is something special that's been created here. All right, do you have a trick? Okay, we'll try one really quick. Okay. i tell you what. Here in my pocket, I have my four favorite playing cards. They're All the right. four queens. Heart, spade, club, diamond. You're going to help me narrow these down to one card, one card only. Okay. I want you to, you're, I just want you to name red or black. 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 I'm going to start by getting rid of the two blacks, the spade, the club. They're both gone. That leaves me a heart and a diamond. Let's get rid of one more. Which one are we getting rid of? The heart. The heart. We'll take the heart, drop it. You're looking for the diamond. A lot. Of, we get that. You know, it happens. Right, you know. So what if I told you that inside of these four, I only had one that was turned over and it was your diamond? Oh, my gosh. I know. And what if I told you that your diamond happened to be the only red card? What? And not only that, but I didn't even bring those other three. All right. Come check him out. This is awesome. Back to you in the studio.